News for Jack's reporter Brittany Muller is standing by with the latest on this effort here in Northeast Florida. Brittany. Zach Jen, good morning. The FDA says it's taken another crucial step in the fight of this global pandemic. Now another 367,000 more vaccines are heading to the state of Florida now that the FDA has approved the Moderna vaccine. But officials say getting it doesn't grant a free pass. And the FDA says uh, while it's uh, granted the emergency use authorization issued for the second vaccine in fighting COVID-19. Six million shipments will roll out this weekend, meaning some local hospitals could get the shots as early as Monday morning. The state says 173 Florida hospitals in 43 counties will get the Moderna vaccine. That's including nearly a dozen here in our community, among them Baptist Medical Center, Mayo Clinic and Memorial Hospital. Governor Ron DeSantis says these hospitals either didn't get enough of Pfizer's vaccine in the first round, or they didn't have the equipment to store it. Moderna's vaccine is easier to store than Pfizer's. Moderna only needs to be stored at negative 13 to negative 5 degrees, and it does not need to be diluted like Pfizer's. It comes ready to go. Both vaccines are said to be about 95% effective, and both need to be given in two doses weeks apart. The second dose must be from the same company as the first. And again, 11 hospitals here in North East Florida, including here at Memorial, could see the Moderna vaccine as early as Monday. And officials say whether you plan to get the vaccine or not, you still need to remain vigilant by washing your hands frequently, remaining social distance, and wearing your mask. Reporting live this morning, Brittany Muller, Channel 4, The Local Station.